one of the worst natural disasters in recorded history was caused by a virus. The influenza pandemic of 1918 struck every major U.S. city, dropping people where they stood. There were at least 20 million people killed worldwide. And it's probably the worst pandemic the world has ever known. There were more people killed from influenza than there were from the First World War. The war itself was the problem. If there had been no war, that year's strain would have stayed isolated. But when Allied troops met in northern France to exchange fire with the enemy, they also exchanged a lethal strain of flu. So it began. It then went from France to the United States and it disseminated from Boston. At Fort Devens, Massachusetts, one case of flu turned into more than 6,000 cases between September 1st and September 18th. It took only 17 days. India lost nearly 4% of its population. Alaska, 8%. In the South Seas, the death rate was 20%. People were absolutely panicked because somebody could be playing bridge one night and they would be dead the next day. And so they did all kinds of things. They were wearing face masks and, um, in fact, the police all wore face masks. They were carrying little pouches of garlic and onion. Just anything that they thought would protect them from the flu. They had no idea that they were leaving exposed the very place where flu enters the body, their noses. Nothing was known about how to cope with it. And that is something that began to emerge when we got into the 1930s, 1940s, and 1950s. By that time, there was enough knowledge and experience and the development of techniques to make it possible to proceed. <laughs> 